They stretch. They smell tasty. They don't stick to your hands. They are perfect to prank your friends with. They are awesome edible slimes. Can you imagine ice cream that doesn't melt in your hands? Do you think it's magic? No, it's a prank. Melt marshmallow in a microwave. Add two spoons of confectionery sugar. Add one spoon of starch. Mix thoroughly. If the mixture is too thin, add more powdered sugar and starch. Keep the two to one ratio of the proportion. Now it's okay. We've got thick and springy slime. You can stretch it and twist it. Roll it up and divide into pieces. Turn each piece into a ball shape. Put them in a bowl. Pour chocolate topping. Add sprinkles. I start eating the ice cream with a spoon. Then I put it aside and pinch off a piece. And it doesn't melt in my fingers. Is it molecular gastronomy? Mold anything with this ice cream and have a snack at the same time. Does your friend like Coca-Cola? Let's amaze her with awesome cola slime. Pour cola into cups. Cut the bottle in half. Pour the beverage into the bottom part. The lid of a Play-Doh container fits perfectly. Attach double-sided tape around the edge. Attach the lid to the bottom half. Cover the top part in the same style. Pour in cola. Let's make the slime. Melt cola-flavored gummy candies in the microwave. Put the powdered sugar and the starch in two to one proportion. Add a few drops of brown food coloring. Mix it up and knead it in your hands. Place the slime between the two bottle halves. Attach the label. Cut it through across to stretch the slime. My friend drinks her cola with a drinking straw. I open my unique bottle in the middle. Here's edible slime. She's amazed. Is it a limited edition? There's a Coca-Cola in two versions, stretchy and liquid. Have a snack and take a drink. My friend likes pranking me with slimes instead of food. This time I'll prank her with edible slime. Put chewy Frutella candies in a bowl. Melt them in the microwave. Add the confectioner sugar and the starch in the usual two to one proportion. Mix the rubber-like mass. Put it in a jar. Decorate it with sprinkles and edible glitter. Keep in mind that this slime can dry in a few minutes, so be quick to prank your friend until it hardens. My friend plays with her slime, showing me how it can stretch thin, turning semi-transparent. It certainly can, as it's made out of hair gel, glue, and thickener. I take my slime out of the jar, but instead of stretching it, I'm going to eat it. She looks suspicious. Her slime is not edible, but mine is flavored with frutella and has a gorgeous smell. Let's make sweet toothpaste to prank your friend. Color the marshmallow slime blue. Put in liquid food coloring. Put on rubber gloves to keep your hands clean. Knead it well. We'll need an empty tube. Cut off the bottom. Tuck the sweet mess into the clean tube. Wrap baking paper around it to seal. Iron it. The toothpaste looks like new. Replace the regular toothpaste with a special one. My friend squeezes it, but there's no expected mint smell. What's wrong with the paste? Has my dream come true? Is this the sweet paste I can eat? It seems my friend is not going to leave the bathroom until she finishes the toothpaste. Do you want a sweet pomegranate? And what about a stretchy sweet pomegranate? Cut a pomegranate in half. 
Cut out the middle. Scoop it out. We've got two empty halves. Melt gummy candies of dark red color in the microwave. Add coloring and mix it with the starch and the powdered sugar. Knead the slime. Add red raspberry drops. Sprinkle the pomegranate half with the starch and put in the slime. Cover it with the other half. Open the pomegranate to find the sweet slime inside. You won't have to struggle with the tiny seeds. Just stretch the pomegranate slime and enjoy the sweet taste. My friend's doing her homework for her art classes. It's the right time to play a painting trick on her. These funny gummies combine a perfect composition for the next prank. Melt the gummy candies of three colors. Put in the powdered sugar and the starch into each bowl. Make edible slimes. Take empty paint containers and put in the slimes. Place them among regular paints in a gouache box. I open the paint and pull out the sweet slime. My friend is impressed. It's great! We can take a short break for a snack. I wish all my paints were sweet. What else can we use as a slime container? Take a stationary glue bottle. Clean an empty glue bottle. Cut off the bottom. Make a hinged lid. Knead our usual sweet slime from melted marshmallows mixed with the powdered sugar and the starch. Tuck it into the bottle. Tape the lid. My friend takes the glue but can't get it out of the bottle. It's so strange. We've got nothing to do with it. Just look, it doesn't stick to your hands. Besides, you can eat it. It's tasty. I take my favorite EOS balm and my friend shifts a mirror closer to me. I don't need it. I'm not going to apply this EOS on my lips. Roll up the slime made out of gummies, starch, and confectionery sugar. Spread oil over the EOS top. Put in the slime ball. Twist tight to close the container. Open it up. Wow, the slime's now shaped exactly like the EOS lip balm. Peel off the excess. It's the amazing slime you can stretch, tear into pieces, and eat. Your friend doesn't quite understand how it's possible. This EOS balm can't moisturize your lips, but it provides good exercise for your finger dexterity instead. I'm going to treat my friend with an unusual orange. Cut an orange in half. Scoop out the flesh. Melt the marshmallow. Add orange food coloring, starch, and confectionery sugar. Knead the slime. Put it in the orange peel. My friend wants to eat an orange. She even takes a napkin to keep clean. Don't worry, this orange is easy to eat. Just stretch it and bite. Just don't try to squeeze any orange juice. There's loose and pressed powder, and there's a slime one. Put the marshmallow-based slime into a clean powder container. I open it and pretend I apply the powder on my friend's face. She doesn't quite understand what I'm doing. The stretchy makeup is too weird. It's better to have a snack. Does your friend want something to eat? I've got a slime pizza. Put the gummy candies in a microwave for a few seconds. Add yellow food coloring into the melted marshmallow. Stir well. Spread the yellow slime all over the crust. Place the melted gummies on top. Decorate it with sprinkles. Cut the sweet pizza. Wow! The slime stretches out like cheese. It makes the dish look like real pizza. Mmm, tasty! You've got edible slimes for any situation. 
You can put them in paint containers or a toothpaste tube. Make the slimes and have fun! Write in your comments which slime prank you liked the most. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Hit the like button and click the bell to be among the first to get new prank ideas.